I looked at the video, and someone needs to remind uh, former Mayor Giuliani that falsely reporting a, a, a crime is a crime. And from what he stated about being punched in the head, uh, felt like a bullet, you know, what he stated, there was a lot of creativity. And I think the district attorney, should, he has the wrong person that he's investigating. To falsely report a crime is a crime. If that video wasn't there, then this person would have been charged with punching the, the former mayor. He would have been charged with all of these offenses that did not materialize. I saw that video. And I'm sure all of you who saw, saw the video, you have to ask yourself, he stated if he, was, he didn't feel so heroic or whatever, he would, have not, he would have fallen to the ground. That was a lot of creativity there. Falsely reporting a crime is a crime. When you look at the video, the, the guy basically walked by and, and, and patted him on the back. I don't know if he said congratulations. I don't know what he said to him. But it was clear that he was not punched in the head. It was clear that it didn't feel like a bullet. It was clear that he wasn't about to fall to the ground. And so it was clear that he had a lot of creativity and sensationalism that caused this person to be arrested. <laughs> Falsely reporting a crime is a crime. Conversation with the police commissioner about do we feel that was a falsely reported crime? Because you can't, see here's my fear. If you don't have a video and someone of prominence making allegations against you, you should not have to wait for a video to determine you did nothing wrong. He's a, pro he's a former mayor. I think it's irresponsible for a former mayor and when I heard the report uh, that he was punched in the head and other things, when I heard that, I said, you know, why would someone assault the former mayor? Now, what if we didn't have the video? This person would have been accused with a serious crime when all he did was pat the guy on the back. You know, you can't do sensationalism to carry out your own agenda. And you can't use the police to carry out your own agenda.